G'day guys and welcome to another video. Today I'll be doing tips for round 11, which is coming up tomorrow at this time I'm making this video. Uh, we've got one game to go and let's have a look how I've gone. I think I've got them all right so far. I tipped Port Adelaide, I tipped Richmond, I tipped Geelong, I tipped Melbourne, tipped the Pies and the Saints. So hopefully the Giants can uh, get the job done for me tonight. They haven't been a happy hunting ground for me to tip this year, but we'll see how we go. Big game to start off though with uh, Port Adelaide and Richmond at Adelaide Oval. Absolutely massive game here. Uh, I think the Tigers, once again, I've been um, backing them in and they've been um, getting the job done for me. And i pretty sure they did the job last year. I think it was last year when they did it, they had no, or it might have been the year before, they had like no Martin, Cochin, Rewalt and Rance. Uh, and they won, so, and this was over there. Um, yeah, I think Richmond, once again, they've got the tools to get the job done. It'll be very tough, and play Adelaide will give them a show. But I didn't think they were super impressive against the Dogs, but we'll wait and see. I, I, I just rate Richmond as one of the best teams in the competition, and they are capable of winning on the road. So, tight game, though, that one. Uh, Brisbane have the Western Bulldogs at the Gabba. I reckon this one will be a tight clash as well, uh, but I think the line's probably in that three goals for the range. We'll get the win, uh, being they don't lose at the Gabba very often. I don't think I've lost there um, probably since 2018, I'd say, uh, during the home and away season, just to clarify that. So I think uh, they will yeah, win again and they'll respond from uh, their poor performance against the Tigers. They weren't necessarily poor, they just couldn't convert um, from the Tigers' pressure. So that's my tip there. Uh, West Coast have Carlton hosting there at Optus Stadium. Uh, I think yeah, Eagles are pretty tough to beat there, as we know. Um, they're going to be tough to sort of take down, and they're flying at the moment. So um, I'm going the Eagles to win here, probably in that five, six goal range. Melbourne then have the North Melbourne Kangaroos at Adelaide Oval. So this one will be tricky as well, but I think Melbourne uh, on the right track. They had a good win at Adelaide Oval against the Crows. So I think in similar line, thinking they'll get the job done there. Um, North, are, yeah, they're going okay-ish, but I think, yeah, Melbourne have the capacity to probably do, probably do a bit more damage on the scoreboard. Wait and see, though. Monday night, we've got a double header. It's going to be these two games. I can't split them, to be honest. Uh, St Kilda and Geelong at the Gabba. Back in the Saints here. Um, they're pretty much nine and zip. They've just, uh, you know, they were up big time against North and also, uh, I'm trying to think of the other club, Fremantle, but uh, went down to them. But they've accepted nearly every challenge um, really well and they've beaten some quality teams on the road and done really well there. So I think they've just been a bit more consistent than Geelong. Uh, and then maybe, yeah, we'll see how those four and five day breaks go um, together with the Cats as well. I'm only thinking that might pull us up a bit. Traditionally a good record against the Saints, but I think, yeah, St Kilda in a tight one, but not sure on that one. Uh, Freeman will have Hawthorne at Optus Stadium. This is also a really tough game to pick on. Yeah, I was leaning towards Hawthorne, but then I also remembered Freeman will beat Collingwood, who I think are better than Hawthorne, but yes, it's going to be tricky. Still deciding. I might change my tip on this one. We'll, we'll wait and see. The teams might um, help me answer the question, but I'm going to go Fremantle, but uh, yeah, not with a great deal of confidence. I can't tip all these teams confidently, to be honest. But I could change the whole thing. I'll, I'll wait and see. They've had a buy. Um, yeah. I'll let you know if I change it. Collingwood have Adelaide at Adelaide Oval. I think the Pies will win this one. They they are a great travelling side, as we know. Um, not so recently against the Dockers, but... Yeah, they uh, they defeated the Swans recently. Adelaide can't put a win together, so um, I don't see them doing it against Collingwood, but they will win one soon, so that's what we do know. Um, not guaranteed, but pretty likely, so I reckon the Pies get over the line there. Gold Coast and Essendon at Metricon Stadium. Uh, unless Essendon put on an amazing display against the Giants, I will probably stick with the Suns here to win. They're tough to beat at home, generally, and um, that's sort of... My line of thinking there, as you can see down below, the Sydney team's having a bit of a buy. They haven't sitting out for this weekend. So I'll let you know if there's any changes, guys, um, for any of the tips throughout the week um, leading up to it all. So 
Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, check us out on the podcast, which I've got uh, linked in the description below. If you want to hear some more AFL talk and banter from the lads, it's good fun. And uh, give the video a like and subscribe, all that amazing stuff. We're getting close to 1,000, so let's get us there. Let's get us there. So thanks again, guys, for sticking around. I'll catch you on the next video.